Hello everybody, my name is Kim and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to validate changes in Storyboard Pro. Now if you've ever worked with changes, you'll know that under your Storyboard menu, Track Changes, there's an Auto Tracking Mode. This means that every time you make a change or put in a revision, it's going to create a yellow highlight on the panel that you want the change created on. Then the artist can go through these changes and check what they need to do, then make adjustments. This way the panel will stay yellow and the director can come back and check and validate or make changes to the changes. So I'm going to be showing you how to do that in this video. So as you can see I've got some panels here that are highlighted yellow. I'm going to go to my storyboard menu, track changes, validate changes. This little pop-up comes up. Now the first thing you're going to see is at the top it's going to tell you how many panels it found with changes in and it's going to tell you where that panel belongs. So on this specific panel, we have a character that's been redrawn. Now I have a couple of options here. I can drop down on this menu. I can either validate all of the panels in this entire storyboard. I can validate just the panels that are in the sequence, or I can validate the panels that are in the scene. I'm just going to leave it on the plain old validate. In other words, this is going to validate whichever panel I'm on. And I'm going to click on that button and you're going to see that now the change has been validated. I don't want any other changes, so we're good to go. We can then go to the next panel and here the camera's been revised, but maybe there's something else that I want fixed. So change Starscape in background. In this case, I'm not going to validate the change because I want them to be able to see the note that I've put for them. So I'm going to say next. And this, that one's going to stay yellow because, again, I didn't validate it. In this one over here, the expression's been revised. If I like the way it looks, I can then again validate this one. Then I can close my box and now you can see that there's just the one panel left that needs to be revised and then validated by whoever is doing the validation. And that's how you validate panels in Storyboard Pro.